Our World, Students Book Three, Copyright 2020, National Geographic Learning, a part of Cengage Learning, all rights reserved. Unit Zero, Track Zero Point One, Activity One, Look, Listen, and Say. How do you say? Borrador in English. It's a rubber. How do you spell scissors? S, C, I, S, S, O, R, S. Could you repeat that, please? Of course. S, C, I, S. S, O, R, S. I don't understand. Can you help me, please? Yes, of course. What's the difference between next to and in front of? The teacher is in front of the class. My desk is next to your desk. Track zero point two. Seasons and months. Activity one. Look, listen, and say. Spring. Summer. Autumn. Winter. Track zero point three. Activity two. Look and listen. Point and say. Autumn. Spring. Winter. Summer. Track zero point four. Activity three. Look, listen, and say. January. February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November. December. Track zero point five. Numbers. Activity one. Look, listen, and say. Twenty. Twenty one. Twenty two. Twenty three. Twenty four. Twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty. Seventy, eighty, ninety, one hundred, one hundred and one, one hundred and two, two hundred, one thousand, one million. One billion plus minus equals track zero point six activity two work with a partner listen do the maths together listen to check your answers. 
24 plus 2 equals 100 plus 10 equals 60 plus 20 equals 80 plus 9 equals 35 plus 5 equals 40 minus 30 equals 300 minus 50 equals 1000 plus 1000 equals 99 minus 9 equals 24 plus 2 equals 26 100 plus 10 equals 110 60 plus 20 equals 80 80 plus 9 equals 89 35 plus 5 equals 40 40 minus 30 equals 10 300 minus 50 equals 250 1000 plus 1000 equals 2000 99 minus 9 equals 90 track 0 0.7 activity 3 look listen and say first second third fourth fifth sixth seventh eighth ninth tenth eleventh twelfth thirteenth fourteenth fifteenth sixteenth seventeenth eighteenth nineteenth twentieth twenty-first Track 0 0.8 Pronouns Activity 1 Look, listen and say The kite is mine The coat is yours The ball is his The bat is hers The, the grapes, grapes are ours the pencils are yours. The game is theirs. Track 0 0.9 Activity 3 Look, listen and say Me You Him Her It us, you, them. Unit 1, track 1.1. .1. Vocabulary 1.
Activity 1. Listen and read. We all need help from other people. We care for each other in many different ways. We care for animals too. Carry. Help. Hug. Teach. Hold hands. Feed my pet. A goldfish. Take care of my pet. A hamster. Pick up. Give my pet a bath. Protect. Track 1.2. Activity 2. Listen and say. Carry. I sometimes carry my rabbit. Help. I always help my grandma. Hug. I hug my mum every day before school. Teach. I teach my friends new things. Hold hands. We hold hands when we cross the road. Feed my pet. I feed my pet twice a day. A goldfish. I feed my goldfish after school. Take care of my pet. I take care of my pet after school. A hamster. I've got a hamster called George. Pick up. I often pick my little brother up. Give my pet a bath. I give my pet a bath every Saturday. Protect. I want to protect my little sister. She's only three. Track 1.3 Song Activity 1 Listen Read and sing I love taking care of my pets I love taking care of my family I love taking care of them all I'm happy to help so many I love taking care of my pets I love picking them up and holding them too But before I can play with my pets I've got some work to do I have to comb my cat, feed my dog Protect my bird and pick up my frog I have to wash my coat, brush my horse And I can't forget to give my snake a bath, of course I love taking care of my pets I love taking care of my family I love taking care of them all I'm happy to help so many I love taking care of my family I love hugging them too But before I get to play with my family I've got some work to do I have to read to my sister, take care of my brothers And hold hands with my grandmother I have to teach my brothers their one, two, three And carry my family's new baby Track 1.4 Grammar 1 Before and After 
What does she do before breakfast? She gets dressed before breakfast. What does he do after school? He feeds his bird after school. Track 1.5 Vocabulary 2 Activity 1 Listen and say Tick T for true or F for false. Have a shower. I have a shower at 7.30. Make my bed. I make my bed at 8.15. Come home. I come home at 3.20. Have a snack. I have a snack at 3.45. Do my homework. I do my homework at five. Track 1.6 Grammar 2 Adverbs of Frequency I never eat lunch at 12.30. I sometimes eat lunch at 12.30. I usually eat lunch at 12.30. I always eat lunch at 12.30. Track 1.7 Reading Activity 1 Listen and read Caring for baby elephants Sometimes Young animals, such as elephants, haven't got parents to take care of them. Who can help them? A group called the David Sheldrick Wildlife Trust helps elephants and other animals in Kenya, in Africa. Sometimes a baby elephant's mother dies. When that happens, the baby hasn't got anyone to take care of it or any milk to drink. People at the trust find the baby elephant and look after it. They feed it milk and protect it. The baby elephants are usually sad at first. They don't want to eat or sleep. People at the trust take turns caring for the baby elephant. They sleep near it and give it milk when it's hungry. The people are like the elephant's new family. After a few weeks, the baby elephant starts to play and make friends with other elephants. Now the people at the trust know that the elephant is happy. In time, the elephant is ready to go back to the wild to live with other elephants. Unit 2, Track 2.1 Vocabulary 1 Activity 1 Listen and read some people live in big towns. Other people live in small villages. In both, there are interesting places to go. Are there places like these where you live? A hospital. A post office. A bakery. A museum. A restaurant. A park. A supermarket. A chemist's. A train station. A cinema.
A toy shop. A police station. Track 2.2. Activity 2. Listen and say. A hospital. Doctors and nurses work in a hospital. A post office. You can send letters and parcels at the post office. A bakery. You can buy bread in a bakery. A museum. You can see paintings in a museum. A restaurant. You can eat food in a restaurant. A park. You can play on the swings in the park. A supermarket. You can buy lots of food at the supermarket. A chemist's. You can get medicine at a chemist's. A train station. You can catch a train at the train station. A cinema. You can watch a film at the cinema. A toy shop. You can buy toys in the toy shop. A police station. Police officers work in a police station. Track 2.3 Song Activity 1 Listen Read and sing Can I help you? You look lost. Can I help you find your way? Can I help you? You look lost. Can I help you today? I'm new in town. I think I'm lost. Can you help me find my way? I'm new in town. Can you help me with my busy day? Where are the post office, the toy shop, the supermarket and the park? Where's the bakery? Where's the library? Where are the zoo, the school and the swimming pool? I think I'm lost, can you help me find my way? I'm new in town, can you help me with my busy day? I can help you, you're not lost, I can help you find your way. I can help you, you're not lost, I can help you today. Here's the post office, here's the toy shop, the supermarket and the park. Here's the bakery, the library, the zoo, the school. Swimming pool and the cinema too I can help you, you're not lost I can help you today I can help you find your way And you'll be okay in your great new town today Thank you for helping me to find my way Thank you for helping me with my busy day In my great new town today in my great new town today. Track 2.4 Grammar 1 Can for requests and offers. Can you help me, please? Of course. How can I help? Track 2.5 Vocabulary 2. Activity 1. Listen and say. Read and write. A library. He wants to go to the library. A swimming pool. I want to go to the swimming pool. A zoo. 
We all want to go to the zoo. A shopping centre. I want to go to the shopping centre. A stadium. They want to go to the stadium. Track 2.6. Activity 2. Listen and stick. When do you want to go to the shopping centre? Let's go on Friday. Do you want to go to the library? I can't today. Let's go on Tuesday. Do you want to go to the museum? Yes. Let's go on Thursday. Are you going to the match on Monday? Yes. I'll see you at the stadium. Do you want to go to the swimming pool today? I can't. Let's go on Wednesday. Track 2.7 Grammar 2 Giving directions. How do I get to the chemists? Go straight on. Turn left onto 3rd Avenue. Turn right at the supermarket. Track 2.8. Reading. Activity 1. Listen and read. Eye in the sky. Satellites are machines in space that circle Earth. They help us talk to people on the other side of the planet. They can also study the planet's weather. This satellite is called GeoI-1. It is the same size as a big car. It takes photos of our planet. These pictures can show our continents and seas. They can show our streets and houses too. On the internet, there are many photos and maps of Earth. We can use these images to help us explore our world. This is a photo of the world. You can see the seven continents. Do you know their names? This is part of Asia, the biggest continent. Now we can see the countries clearly. Here we can see South Korea. Now we can see one town. This is Pohang in South Korea. Look, can you see two stadiums? Unit 3, track 3.1 Vocabulary 1 Activity 1 Listen and read Transport helps us move around. We can travel in the sky, on water or on land. Which is your favourite? A bus. An aeroplane. A ferry. A helicopter. The underground. A sailing boat. A hot air balloon. A ship. A scooter. A scooter. A taxi. A motorbike. Track 3.2. Activity 2. Listen and say. A bus. We get the bus to school. An aeroplane. Can you see an aeroplane in the sky? 
a ferry. Look at all the cars on the ferry. A helicopter. That helicopter is really loud. The underground. Let's get the underground to the museum. A sailing boat. That sailing boat is fast. A hot air balloon. Look, that hot air balloon is very colourful. A ship. That's a big ship. A scooter. I ride my scooter in the park. A scooter. You should wear a helmet on this scooter. A taxi. My uncle drives a taxi. A motorbike. I want to ride a motorbike. Track three point three. Song. Activity one. Listen. Read and sing. How do you get to school? 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 I get the bus to school. I do too. I ride my bike to school. I do too. How do you get to school? 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 My mum drives me to school. My mum does too. Yes, I do. I get the train to school. Do you get it too? How do you get to school? 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 Be careful on your way to school. Track three point four. Grammar one, two. For agreeing, I ride my scooter to school. I do too. I get the bus to school. I don't. I get the underground. My brother rides his bike to school. My brother does too. My sister rides her skateboard to school. My sister doesn't. She walks. Track three point five. Activity two. Marco is doing a survey. Listen and tick. Hi, Miguel. I'm doing a survey. How do you get to school? I ride my bike. How about you, Carlos? How do you get to school? I ride my scooter. Hello, Fernanda. How do you get to school? I get the bus. Hi, Rosario. I'm doing a survey. How do you get to school? I ride my scooter. Thomas, how do you get to school? 
I walk. And you, Graciella? How do you get to school? I get the bus. Track 3.6 Vocabulary 2 Activity 1 Listen and say. Read and write. Get on. I get on my bike. Pedal uphill. I pedal uphill. Coast downhill. I coast downhill. Get off. I get off my bike. Park. I park my bike. Track 3.7. Activity 2. Listen and stick. OK. First, I get on my bike. Like this. This first part is down the hill. So, I coast downhill. Whee! Now I have to pedal uphill again. This is difficult. <sighs> I'm there! Great! Now I get off the bike and park it. Track 3.8 Grammar 2 But as a contrast my mum gets the bus to work, but my dad gets the underground. Track 3.9 Reading Activity 1 Listen and read Hot air balloons It's always exciting to see a colourful hot air balloon in the sky. But here... There are hundreds. In October, every year, people gather at the International Balloon Fiesta in Albuquerque, USA. About 600 balloons are up in the sky at the same time. How does a hot air balloon fly? When the balloon is on the ground, People light gas to make a small fire. The fire heats the air in the balloon. Because hot air always rises, the balloon begins to go up into the air. The pilot of the balloon stands in the basket and lights the gas to go higher. The wind then blows the balloon along. Usually, there's a group of people on the ground called the chase team. They follow the balloon in a van. The chase team uses a radio to talk to the pilot. The pilot looks for a safe place to land the balloon and tells the chase team where to go. Then the chase team takes the balloon and the pilot back home. Track 3.10 Units 1 to 3 Extended Reading Activity 1 Listen and Read the Lion and the Mouse Lion is sleeping in the grass. Little Mouse doesn't see Lion. She runs right over Lion's big paw. 
Aha! I've got you, says Lion. Lucky me! I always eat a snack when I wake up. Mmm, what a nice snack! He picks Mouse up. Oh, please, don't eat me, says Mouse. One day I can help you. You help me? A little mouse? Ha <laughs> ha! says Lion. He laughs and laughs. You're lucky. I'm not very hungry today. You can go. He drops Mouse. Mouse runs away. Many days later, Mouse is running in the grass again. She hears Lion. Roar! Oh, roar! Help! Please, can anybody help me? asks Lion. He is in a big net. He is worried and angry. I can't get out, Lion says. I can help you, says Mouse. I can use my teeth. I can chew the net. Mouse chews and chews. Soon, Lion is free. Thank you, Mouse, says Lion. You're welcome, says Mouse. Even a little mouse can help a big lion. Unit 4, Track 4.1 Vocabulary 1 Activity 1 Listen and read. We use our eyes, ears, nose, tongue and skin to learn about the world around us. Smooth Rough Beautiful Ugly Hard Soft Dry Delicious Terrible Quiet Loud Sticky. Track 4.2. Activity 2. Listen and say. Smooth. The door is smooth. Rough. The tree is rough. Beautiful. This bird is beautiful. Ugly. This bird is ugly. Hard. This chair is hard. Soft. This chair is soft. Dry. Why is it dry? Delicious. This ice cream is delicious. Terrible. This food is terrible. Quiet. Shh! Be quiet. Loud. The music is too loud. Sticky. This is very sticky. Track 4.3.
Song. Activity 1. Listen. Read and sing. How does a cake taste? It tastes sweet. How does a kitten feel? It feels soft. Track 4.4 Grammar 1 Sense Verbs The soup smells great. The music sounds terrible. The flowers look beautiful. The baby rabbit feels soft. How does the chicken taste? It tastes delicious. Track 4.5 Vocabulary 2 Activity 1 Listen and say. Read and write. Sweet This honey is very sweet. Salty The crisps are salty. Bitter. Black coffee tastes bitter. Sour. Lemons are sour. Spicy. These chilies are very spicy. Track 4.6. Activity 2. Listen and stick. Work with a partner. Check your answers. OK. Food number one. That is spicy. Don't eat it. It's a chilli. And now, number two. Oh, that's sour. That's lemon, I think. And number three. Yum! My favourite! That's very sweet. It's strawberry ice cream. Right. Number four. Mmm! These are salty. They're crisps. And the last one. Number five. Mmm, I know what that is. It's very bitter. It's black coffee. Track 4.7 Grammar 2 Was, were How is the ice cream? It's delicious. 
How was the ice cream? It was delicious. More, please. How were the cookies? They were great. Can I have one more, please? Track 4.8 Reading Activity 1 Listen and read. Amazing Animal Senses Many animals can see, hear, smell, taste and touch. But they do it in a different way to humans. Imagine that you have to walk on your food to taste it. Well, a butterfly does. It tastes with its feet. People use the ends of their fingers to touch. Seals use their whiskers. Their sense of touch is amazing. They can feel fish moving through the water 180 metres, 590 feet away. Spiders haven't got ears. They hear using hundreds of small hairs. On their legs. We can smell delicious food in front of a restaurant, but we can't smell food in a different town. Bears can. Bears have got a fantastic sense of smell. They can smell things that are as far as 32 kilometers, 20 miles away. Chameleons can see very well. Look at their eyes. One eye looks up and the other eye looks down. They can see all around them. Unit 5. Track 5.1. Vocabulary 1. Activity 1. Listen and read. We all need a place to live. We live in houses or flats in our neighbourhood. Animals and plants need a place to live too. This place is called their habitat. Wetlands Grasslands A forest a desert, a rainforest, ice, snow, mud, a web, a hive, a nest, underground, an island. A cave. Track 5.2. Activity 2. Listen and say. Wetlands. Many birds live in the wetlands. Grasslands. Zebras and lions live in the grasslands. A forest. There are many trees and plants in the forest. A desert. It is very hot in the desert. A rainforest. There are many trees in the rainforest. Ice. Water changes to ice in very cold temperatures. Snow It is very cold in the snow. Mud Hippos like bathing in the mud. A web Spiders make webs. A hive. Bees live in hives. A nest.
birds live in nests. Underground. Many animals have homes underground. An island. An island has got water all around it. A cave. Caves are very dark places. Track 5.3. Song. Activity 1. Listen. Read and sing. Why has a giraffe got a long, long neck? Why? Why? Because it eats leaves at the tops of the trees. I want to know why. I want to know why. Why? Because I want to know why. Why has a frog got strong legs? Why? Why? Because it hops, swims, and jumps. I want to know why. I want to know why. Why? Because I want to know why. Animals are amazing. They can do so many things. And I've got just one thing to say. Why? Why has a polar bear got white fur? Why? Why? Because it lives in ice and snow. I want to know why. I want to know why. Why? Because I want to know why. I want to know why. I want to know why. Why? Because I want to know why. Track 5.4. Grammar 1. Why? Because. Why has a giraffe got a long neck? Because it eats leaves at the tops of trees. Why don't you like penguins? Because they look silly and they can't fly. Track 5.5 Vocabulary 2 Activity 1 Listen and say Write the animals in the correct groups. A tongue. A giraffe has got a long tongue. Fur. A polar bear has got thick white fur. Horns. A goat has got two horns. A pouch. A kangaroo has got a pouch. Wings. A parrot has got colourful wings. Track 5.6. Grammar 2. Infinitive of purpose. Giraffes use their long tongues to clean their ears. Goats use their horns to fight. Track 5.7 Reading Activity 1 Listen and read Amazing rainforests Rainforests are warm, wet forests. They are in countries near the equator. In Central America, South America, Africa, Southeast Asia, 
and Australia. Rainforests are important. They are homes for millions of animals and plants. The plants in rainforests make a lot of the oxygen that people in the world need to live. A rainforest has got four parts. Emergent. In this part, you can see the tops of very tall trees. They are sometimes sixty meters, two hundred feet tall. Many different birds, butterflies, and other insects live here. Canopy. In this part of the forest, the trees have got many leaves. Birds, spiders, tree frogs, monkeys, and snakes live here. Understory. In this part of the forest, it is dark, wet, and cool. There aren't many plants. Why? Because plants need light to live. Snakes and lizards live here. Jaguars like to live in this part too. Forest floor. In this part, there are a lot of insects and spiders. Some spiders are as big as plates. There are many large animals, and people live here too. Unit six, track six point one, vocabulary one, activity one. Listen and read. We all love food. We can find food in shops or at the market. What's your favourite food? Let's go shopping. A loaf of bread. A bottle of oil. A bag of rice. A jar of olives. A box of cereal. A bowl of sugar. A bunch of bananas. A glass of juice. A can of fizzy drink. A piece of cake. Track six point two, activity two. Listen and say. A loaf of bread. Can you buy me a loaf of bread? A bottle of oil. There's a bottle of oil on the table. A bag of rice. This bag of rice is very heavy. A jar of olives. This is a big jar of olives. A box of cereal. Let's get a big box of cereal. A bowl of sugar. Where's the bowl of sugar? A bunch of bananas. Look at that big bunch of bananas. A glass of juice. Can I have a glass of juice, please? A can of fizzy drink. I'd like a can of fizzy drink, please. A piece of cake. That piece of cake looks delicious. Track six point three. Song. Activity one. Listen. Read and sing. Let's go shopping.
shopping. Let's go shopping. Let's go shopping today. Let's go shopping to buy some food, then go home to put it away. A jar of jam is no fun if there isn't any bread to spread it on. A bowl of rice is very nice, but it tastes better with some spice. Track six point four, grammar one, some and any. Are there any oranges? Yes, there are some in the fruit bowl. Are there any bananas? No, there aren't any. Is there any milk? Yes, there is some in the fridge. Is there any bread? No, there isn't any. Track six point five. Vocabulary two, activity one. Listen and say. Read and write. Money. I need some money. Put away. Put away the tomatoes, please. A price. Is that the price? That's a lot. Compare. It's important to compare the prices when you shop. Buy. I buy strawberries at the market. Track six point six, activity two. Listen and stick. Work with a partner. Number one. When you go shopping, don't forget your. Number two. If you haven't got any money, you can't anything. Number three. Look at the. Number four. Always two products and buy the better one. Number five. When you get home. The milk and the ice cream first, or don't put away the ice cream. Eat it. Track six point seven, grammar two, a few and a little. Are there any biscuits? Yes, there are a few. Is there any orange juice? Yes. There is a little.
track 6.8. Reading. Activity 1. Listen and read. What's for lunch? Millions of children around the world have lunch at school. Some bring their lunch from home. Others eat food that the school makes for them. Schools in different countries make different kinds of lunches. In France, children eat together in a cafeteria. They have a big lunch because they don't eat snacks in the morning. Sometimes they eat fish or meat with vegetables or salad. Then they might have fruit or a piece of cake. In Japan, children usually eat their lunch in the classroom. They eat soup, rice or noodles, fish and vegetables. They drink milk, too. After lunch, all the children work together to clean the classroom. In Brazil, children might eat rice and beans, salad and cooked vegetables or meat for lunch. Sometimes they eat fruit as well. In Russia, children eat vegetable soup and fish or meat with bread. One delicious soup, called borscht, is made from a dark red vegetable called beetroot. Track 6.9 Extended Reading Activity 1 Listen and Read The Gingerbread Man Grandma makes a beautiful gingerbread man. Mmm, I'm hungry. I want to eat you, says Grandma. The gingerbread man jumps up. He says, You can't eat me! Run, run, as fast as you can! You can't catch me! I'm the gingerbread man! Grandma is surprised. The gingerbread man runs out of the house. Grandma runs after him. He runs to a forest. He sees a fox. Mmm, I'm hungry, says the fox. I want to eat you. The gingerbread man says, you can't eat me. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. He sees a coyote. Mmm, I'm hungry, says the coyote. I want to eat you. The coyote runs after the gingerbread man. The gingerbread man says, You can't eat me! Run, run as fast as you can! You can't catch me! I'm the gingerbread man! He runs to a river. He sees a turtle. I'm not hungry. I don't want to eat you, says the turtle. Oh, good, says the gingerbread man. I have to cross the river. Can you help me, please? Yes, I can, says the turtle. Jump on my back. The gingerbread man jumps on the turtle's back. They swim across the river. The gingerbread man jumps off the turtle's back. He says, Thank you! and runs away. Run, run! As fast as you can! You can't catch me! 
I'm the gingerbread man. Unit 7, track 7.1. Vocabulary 1, activity 1. Listen and read. It's important to take care of your body. Exercise and good food help keep you fit and healthy. A muscle. Fingers. A chest. A stomach. A knee. A bone. A shoulder. An elbow. A back. Toes. Stretch. Bend. Track 7.2. Activity 2. Listen and say. A muscle. I've got strong muscles. Fingers. I've got ten fingers. A chest. This is my chest. A stomach. I'm not hungry. My stomach is full. A knee. Point to your knees. A bone. I've got strong bones. A shoulder. I'm touching my shoulder. An elbow. I've got two elbows. A back. I can touch my back. Toes. I've got ten toes. Stretch. Stretch your legs. Bend. Bend your arms. Track 7.3. Song. Activity 1. Listen. Read and sing. We like feeling fit. We like having fun. We like playing a lot. Let's move now, everyone. We want to feel healthy. We want to get fit. Come on, everybody, stand up. Don't sit. What did you do to get fit yesterday? What did you do to feel strong? What did you do to feel happy yesterday? What did you do? Did you move your legs? Yes, I did. Did you stretch your back? I did that a lot. Did you get an a lot. Let's jump now, everyone. We want to feel healthy. We want to get fit. Come on, everybody, stand up. Don't sit. What did you do to get fit yesterday? What did you do to feel strong? What did you do to feel happy yesterday? What did you do? Did you stretch your muscles? Yes, I did. Did you touch your toes? Did that a lot? Did you bend your knees? Yes, I did. Did you wiggle your nose? Oh no, I forgot. Don't worry, tomorrow is another day. You can try again. It's okay. We like feeling fit. We like having fun. We like playing a lot. Let's dance now, everyone. We want to feel healthy. We want to get fit. Come on, everybody, stand up. Don't sit. Track 7.4. Grammar 1. Past simple. Yes, no questions and short answers. 
Did you wash your hands this morning? Yes, I did. Did you brush your teeth? No, I didn't. Did he have a shower? Yes, he did. Track 7.5 Vocabulary 2 Activity 1 Listen and say Read and write Do exercise I do exercise every day. Eat junk food. I sometimes eat junk food. Eat vegetables. Do you eat vegetables every day? Get some rest. It's important to get some rest when you're tired. Eat fruit. I eat fruit every day after school. Track 7.6 Grammar 2 Two and enough I don't drink too many fizzy drinks. I think I do enough exercise. I don't drink enough water. I eat too much junk food. Track 7.7 .7. Reading Activity 1 Listen and read. Take care of your brain. We all know that it's important to exercise, but we don't always want to do it. Some people think that exercising every day is too hard or that it takes too long. They think they haven't got time to exercise every day. Well, here's some good news. If you exercise for only 10 minutes a day, your body and your brain will feel better. In fact, some scientists believe that 10 minutes of exercise every day can make you think more quickly. Exercise isn't the only thing that's good for your brain. Scientists believe that spending time outside is also great for your brain and your body. They know that your brain relaxes when you're outdoors in a natural place like a forest. Some scientists think people should have a forest bath or spend time in an outdoor place whenever they can. Even laughing is good for your brain. When you laugh, especially if you laugh out loud, your brain gets more blood than when you're sad. Your whole body can feel better for up to 45 minutes after a good laugh. Think about it. Are you taking good care of your brain? Do you do enough exercise? Do you spend enough time outdoors? Do you laugh enough? Unit 8, Track 8.1 Vocabulary 1, Activity 1 Listen and read People all over the world have special celebrations. They take time to remember the past, meet family and friends, eat food and have fun. A costume a feast, a mask, a lantern, a party, fireworks, celebrate, remember, dance, dress up, decorations, a parade.
Track 8.2 Activity 2 Listen and say A costume Do you like my costume? A feast There's lots of food at this feast A mask I love the colours on this mask a lantern. This lantern is beautiful. A party. I like going to parties. Fireworks. The fireworks are loud and colourful. Celebrate. We celebrate my birthday every year. Remember. I remember my great grandparents. Dance. I always dance at parties. Dress up. Let's dress up as superheroes. Decorations. I love these party decorations. A parade. It's time to watch the parade. Track 8.3 Song Activity 1 Listen Read and sing We went to a carnival Everyone was there we dressed up, sang some songs, and watched a parade, but best of all. We danced to music, wonderful music, we danced to music all day long. We danced to music, wonderful music, we danced to music all day long. Did you like the food? Yes, I like the food. Did you dress up? Yes, I went as a frog. We danced to music, wonderful music. We danced to music all day long. We danced to music, wonderful music. We dance to music all day long Did you like the costumes? Yes, I like the costumes Did you see any masks? Yes, we saw some masks Wonderful music, we dance to music all day long. We dance to music, wonderful music, we dance to music all day long. Track 8.4 Grammar 1 Past Simple Regular Verbs did you watch the parade? Yes, we watched the parade. Did you like the music? Yes, we liked it a lot. Track 8.5 Vocabulary 2 Activity 1 Listen and say Read and write A present Here's a present for you. Happy birthday! A birthday cake. I love birthday cake. 
candles. There are seven candles on the cake. An invitation. It's an invitation to a party. Balloons. There are ten balloons. Track 8.6 Activity 2 Listen and stick. OK. What do we need to do for your birthday party? We can give people the invitations first. Yes, great. We can write the invitations today. Then... We can make the birthday cake. Can we have a chocolate cake? Yes, of course. And I've got nine candles to put on the cake too. OK. And then we can blow up the balloons. Yes, perfect. Then we are ready. And then you can give me my presents. Yes, then we can give you your presents. Track 8.7 Grammar 2 Past Simple Irregular Verbs Did you go to the parade? Yes, I went to the parade. Did you see the fireworks? Yes, I saw the fireworks. Did you eat a piece of cake? Yes, I ate a piece of cake. Track 8.8 .8. Reading Activity 1 Listen and read November Celebrations The Day of the Dead is a big festival in Mexico. People celebrate it at the beginning of November. They remember and celebrate the dead people in their families. They sometimes decorate graves in the cemetery with skeletons in special costumes. Families take a big feast to the cemetery, and they light candles and play music. People give sweets and chocolate in the shape of skulls. For Mexicans, skulls and skeletons are not scary, and the festival is not sad. The Day of the Dead is a time for fun and happy celebrations. In Thailand, the festival of Yi Peng usually happens in November too. On the first day, there is a parade and people wear beautiful costumes. People make lanterns out of rice paper. They light small candles inside them. On the night of the festival, thousands of bright lanterns go up into the sky. People believe that the lanterns are taking away the bad things in their lives. People also decorate their homes and gardens with paper lanterns. On the last day, there are fireworks. Unit 9, Track 9.1 Vocabulary 1, Activity 1 Listen and read The weekend is a time to relax and do fun things. Sometimes we stay at home. Sometimes we go out and visit places, play outside or see friends. Eat out. Go to the cinema. Visit a museum. Go on a picnic. Stay at home. Go to the beach. Lose. Win. Exciting.
Interesting. Text my friends. Busy. Track 9.2. Activity 2. Listen and say. Eat out. We eat out on Sundays. Go to the cinema. I like going to the cinema at the weekend. Visit a museum. Sometimes we visit a museum in the city. Go on a picnic. Do you want to go on a picnic today? Stay at home. I sometimes stay at home at the weekend. Go to the beach. I want to go to the beach and swim in the sea today. Lose. I don't like it when we lose games. Win. My football team always wins. Exciting. This is so exciting. Let's do it again. Interesting. This is really interesting. Look. Text my friends. I text my friends at the weekend. Busy. I am very busy today. I've got lots of things to do. Track 9.3 Song Activity 1 Listen Read and sing Spare time, spare time, spare time is great There is no school and I can get up late In my spare time I like having fun I throw and catch, I jump and run What did you do at the weekend? Did you stay at home? Did you have some? What did you do at the weekend? Did you go outside and play in the sun? Did you go fishing? Did you play tennis? Did you go hiking? What did you do? Did you go swimming? Did you go ice skating? Did you go horse riding? I didn't go fishing or hiking. I didn't go swimming or ice skating. I played a game. With my little brother, I went to the cinema with my mother. What did you do at the weekend? Did you stay at home? Did you have some fun? What did you do at the weekend? Did you go outside and play in the sun? Did you go fishing? Did you play tennis? Did you go hiking? What did you do? Did you go swimming? Did you go ice skating? Did you go horse riding? at home. I played with everyone. I lost at tennis, but it was fun. I texted friends. I helped cook dinner. When I help out, I feel like a winner. What did you do at the weekend? Did you stay at home? Did you have some fun? What did you do at the weekend? Did you go outside and play in the sun? What did you do at the weekend? Did you stay at home? Did you have some fun? What did you do at the weekend? Did you go outside and play in the sun? Spare time, spare time, spare time is great. There is no school and I can get up late. In my spare time, I like having fun. I dance and sing, I play and run. Track 9.4 Grammar 1 Past Simple Questions and Negatives how was your weekend? It was boring. I didn't do anything special. What did you do? I went to a football match. Did your team win? No, they didn't win. They lost. Track 9.5 Vocabulary 2 Activity 1 Listen and say Read and write. Go horse riding. 
Can we go horse riding one day? Go fishing. Let's go fishing tomorrow. Go hiking. I love to go hiking in the mountains. Go swimming. Can we go swimming in the river? Go ice skating. Where can we go ice skating in this town? Track 9.6. Grammar 2. Go plus verb plus ing. What do you do at the weekend? We usually go hiking. What did you do last weekend? We didn't go hiking. We went swimming. Track 9.7 Reading Activity 1 Listen and read Wow! Look at that! Museums are great places to visit at the weekend. They teach us about the world in fun ways. Many museums have special exhibitions for children. Other museums are all for children. Are these dinosaurs escaping from a museum? At the Children's Museum in Indianapolis, USA, there are giant models of dinosaurs outside. Some of them are running away and others are looking in through the window. In one exhibit, called National Geographic Treasures of the Earth, you can learn a lot about the history of Egypt. Inside the museum, there are real dinosaur fossils, rooms about science, art, culture, history and much more. You can learn about the stars in the planetarium. You can go to the theatre. And you can even go rock climbing. Track 9.8 Extended Reading Activity 1 Listen and read. The Paralympics You've probably heard of the Olympic Games. People from many countries come together every four years to run, swim and play other sports at the Olympics. Another great sporting event, called the Paralympic Games, also takes place every four years. At the Paralympics, people with disabilities come together to run, swim and compete at sports. Years ago, people with disabilities didn't take part in many sports. Now, at the Paralympics, they compete in a lot of different sports, such as skiing, wheelchair tennis and judo. At the beginning of the Games, they dress in their national uniforms and take part in parades. When they win, they receive medals that celebrate their strength. Daniel Dias was born without any hands and with only one foot. At school, children called him names. He stayed at home a lot. He didn't do much. When he was 16, Daniel watched the Paralympics on TV and saw disabled people like him swimming. He exercised and learnt to swim. Soon, he was fit and strong. He was also very fast. He won gold medals in his first Paralympic Games in Beijing. The Paralympic Games changed Daniel's life. 
They are also helping to change how people see Paralympians and other people with physical disabilities. Track 10.1 This is our world Everybody's got a song to sing Each boy and girl This is our world I say our, you say world Our, world, our, world I say boy, you say girl Boy, girl, boy, girl I say everybody move I say everybody stop 